Hi, I'm Susan Solovic, the small business expert, and here's your daily tip. Don't compete on price. Define your value. A lot of small businesses have confided in me that during this recession, they have felt compelled to compete on price, and they have slashed their prices and slashed their prices until they're barely making it by. The problem with that is they're not defining their value. You see, people will pay for what they value. So if you feel as though you're constantly having to go in as the low bid provider, then you probably haven't done a good job of explaining to your customer why they would want to pay a premium price for your product or service. You're afraid to ask for what you're really worth. And trust me, you're worth every penny. All you have to do is think about Apple computers. Now, I don't know if you've gone into an Apple store recently, but in the height of the recession, a shopping mall could be nearly vacant, but you go into an Apple computer store and people would be lined up waiting to buy products. Not just one little item, but armfuls of product. An Apple computer is not the cheapest market, not the cheapest product on the market. It's expensive. Why do they do that? Because they believe in the value Apple brings. That's what you want for your business. You want to be able to define the value. And remember this, if you find yourself constantly competing on price, there's always going to be somebody who's willing to go in and undercut you. Especially if you find yourself competing with big box suppliers and big chain stores. It's a tough kind of a situation and competition to be in. So learn to define your value, ask for what you're worth, and watch your small business success soar. I'm Susan Solovic, the small business expert, and that was your daily tip.